Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this video I have for you today is a haul of two D stashes that I purchased from Kirby Welsh, who is the owner of Vintage Chic Scents. Um, before Kirby was an owner, um, she was a waxaholic, I guess, like most of us. And she's the one that actually got me started in buying vendor wax because I found her channel on YouTube and absolutely like had to have wax from the different vendors that she would show. Um, so this is the first D stash I've ever purchased from her. Um, just I think other times she's listed it, either I was too late in seeing it or whatever, I don't know. But um, these D stashes she posted on Sunday. Today's Wednesday. So she posted on Sunday and I paid for them. She shipped them Monday and I got them today. So super fast turnaround time for her. Um, and she is known for having amazing D stashes and pricing them very reasonably. So I got two large flat rate boxes that were $60 each and they are like stuffed full. And when I got them, the um, they smell so good. Our like front desk person in my office, she's the one that always gets them, you know, from the the post office person, and she brings them to my office, and she was like, "Oh my gosh, these are the best smelling boxes you've gotten so far," because she knows I have a problem with buying wax. But anyhow, now I don't need more wax, and when I first saw Kirby post these, I was kind of like, "I don't need it, I don't need it," and then I justified it to myself because I've gotten my family into melting wax, and my sister is like always posting every day on her Facebook like what she's melting for the day but they don't have the finances to actually buy it themselves so what I thought I was gonna do or what I'm planning on doing is giving these two boxes to my mom and my sister so that they have a great variety from a bunch of different vendors I know like what Kirby likes as far as scents that she likes to melt so I know that these will be ones that my mom and my sister will really enjoy so now I may take a few that I find if there's vendors maybe that I haven't tried before or some scents that I'm like oh my god I love this I may steal either a couple pieces or like if it's a small chunk just keep it for myself so there may be a few things I will keep but um, for the most part I would say like 98% of these boxes are gonna go to my mom and my sister so the other thing is for this video, I'm not going to smell everything and give you guys a scent description. I'm basically just going to show you what it includes, otherwise we would be here forever. So um, I will go ahead and get started. And this is not going to be in any particular order because I'm just pulling stuff out of the boxes. So this first one, this is um, Butter Brickle Little Bites. And I know, so this is obviously a sample from Candles from the Keeping Room. Um, me, I don't care if samples are sold in D stashes as long as the D stash is priced reasonably that you're not really paying for, you know, the samples. So um, because this the price of this D stash was so cheap, like I expect there to be freebies in here. That is completely fine with me. So that's one. Um, the coveted Rose Girls. Um, this is Summer Lovin'. A nice chunk, great size chunk in that. Um, she did throw in one of her own, well, she doesn't have a label on these, but, well, she has a, the scent label, but I guess there's no vintage chic scents label, but one of her own, um, which I will probably keep this one, this is Autumn in Salem, so this is from Vintage Chic Scents. This is Candles by Victoria, Raspberry Banana Guava. I think this is in her new wax formula, because this looks a lot softer than what I have from her in her old harder wax. Candles by Victoria Coco Coconut Lemongrass. Candles by Victoria Tropical Blast. I'm telling you, these boxes were stuffed. Candles by Victoria Strawberry White Cake. Um, the Bathing Garden Drink Me. It's a full clamshell. Candles by Victoria Strawberry Milk. And look at how adorable this is. I don't know if this is like supposed to be kind of a scoopable, but this one does smell amazing. This is one that I thought about. I haven't gone through and sniffed all of these. I kind of just peeked through the box a little bit when I first got it. This is one that I did see and smell, and I'm tempted to keep it because I love strawberry and it smells fantastic. 
This is a full bag from Candles from the Keeping Room and Cream Soda. I know, my color is looking funky. Um, it looks it looks like it's full. I have the scent already, so this is definitely one I'm going to pass on to my sister and or my mom. I basically am going to let them just go through and start picking things. Um, this is a bag from Tiffany Candles and her Chunklets Coconut Cream Pie with Lemon Poppy Seed Overpour. And this is an example where I may pull out a couple chunks just to have as like samples for myself. Another Tiffany Candles Chunklets bag in Marshmallow Sugar Cookies with Strawberry Fields Overpour. Again, one that I will probably pull out a couple of the chunklets to have for myself. My camera's like very wobbly. And the color is just not very good right now. Sorry. This massive bag in Lake Providence Lodge, and this is in Lemon Fluff Cake. This is a company I think I have from the giveaway that I won from Kim, who is the Make Sense admin on the Facebook group. Um, I think I got a scent shot from them, one or two scent shots from them, but I haven't tried you know much else. This is like four massive squares. Um, I don't know. I may keep a square. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. We will have to see. Okay. Um, this is L3 Blackberry Jam. Blackberry Jam Lemon Sugar Twinkies. Candles by Victoria White Nectarine and Pink Coral. I think I actually have this Oh, you know, I think this was a scent I tried once from Tiffany Candles, I believe. Okay, so here's, oh no, this one I won't keep. This is Up the Creek Scents Frankenberry Zucchini Bread. I actually have this same in a scoopable from Up the Creek, so that I will definitely be passing on. But here's one that I'm probably going to keep. Um, burnt Sugared Zucchini Bread. Everyone raves about this from Up the Creek, so that's probably one I'm going to keep, or at least keep a couple tarts of. Tiffany Candles Fluffy Marshmallow. I have a whole scoopable of that guy, so I don't need that. Here's another one that I actually smelled and I'm like, oh my god, it smells amazing. It's Pear, Strawberry Jam, and Honeydew Melon from Rose Girls. It's one of their like um, cupcakes. This, I don't normally like pear, but this combination smells amazing. They have, oh my god, it's so amazing. I, the honeydew melon is fantastic, so I'm probably going to keep that one. <sighs> Don't judge me, guys. From 30 Street Wax, which is a vendor I have not tried yet, this is Velveteen Rabbit, which this is honey and toffee, um, fresh notes of citrus, baby powder, jasmine, sweet and playful notes of cotton candy, raspberries, and sweet lemon. There is other 30 Street, so I may keep one or two pieces just to try her stuff out, but there's that. Um, from Sniff My Tarts, this is three of their really big Hello Kitty heads in pink butter cookies. So that's pink sugar butter cookie. I love Sniff My Tarts. I have so much stuff from them, though. Here's another one from Sniff My Tarts in Vanilla Smoothie, Lemon Cream Puff, Serendipity Smoothie. This is a massive chunk. It's like the size of my palm, a little bit bigger than the size of my palm. From um, Super Tarts, this is Starfleet, and it's like two little pieces in there. Um, I've never smelled this one. I'm gonna smell it real quick. I do not know what the scent description is. Oh, that's really good. It's like berries and bakery. Hmm, that may be one I have to keep, maybe. From Tiffany Candles, this is a scoopable in Winter Dreams, which is like a sweet cinnamon, um, completely full. It smells so good. It's sweet cinnamon, and then is there like a pine or something in it? Maybe kind of that wintry thing. I probably won't keep this one. I think I'll pass that on to my mom or my sister. It smells really good, but again, trying not to increase the size of my stash. From Lasting Scent Candles, Summertime Blues. I've melted this one before. It's a great blueberry. I'll probably pass it on. From Tiffany Candles, Olive Leaves. From the Glitterati, Mango Mint Sweet Tea. I'll be coming up probably in about a month on my custom order with Glitterati. 
um, from Candles from the Keeping Room, Miss Possum's Treats. From Glitterati, Lemon Flower Basil. From 30 Street Crafts, um, Mooseberry Cobbler, which is fresh glass, fresh Alaskan blueberries um, in a with a buttery cobbler. Ground cinnamon, vanilla, so that sounds really good. There's like two chunks in there. Not two chunks, but two of those um, cameo head type things. From Rainbow Melts, this is Sweet Bubbles in like little, are those like rose shapes or something? Um, from 30 Street Crafts, Nectarine. I'm going to smell this one. It's mm, pretty good. From L3, Snow White's Downfall and B Day Cake. Birthday cake. So, Snow White's Downfall is apple. Ooh, that's, that's a nice fresh apple. I mostly get the apple in that one. Oops, I have a sticker stuck on my hand. Um, Kissing Booth. I've actually never ordered from them. I don't even know if they're still open, but this is the Grown Ups. After Church, the Grown Ups. This is from June, huh? This is pretty recent. It's a bunch of little lips. That's really cute. From Front Porch Fruit Festival for pack of grubbies. There is a big old pile of wax in front of you guys. From Front Porch, a four pack of strawberry Mountain Dew. From Daphne's Glazed Jelly Donut Sugar Cookie. And that one's kind of light, has cute little things on there. From Candles from the Keeping Room, Vanilla Fudge Filled Twinkies. From the Bathing Garden, Happy Unbirthday, which is a full clamshell. From Tiffany Candle, Stormwatch. I've heard a lot of people talk about this one. I think it's a Yankee dupe, right? Hmm. Ooh, I don't know. Okay. Let's see. From Super Tarts, Root Beer Float. It's cute three layers. Ooh, it smells like root beer. It's decorated really cute. From Candles from the Keeping Room, it looks like it's a full bag of Watermelon Jolly Rancher. We have the her pancake shapes. I'm going to push some of this stuff back. This is still the first box, you guys. <laughs> from Candles from the Keeping Room, Coconut Strawberry Cake. Um, what I may do with these two is like divide them up between my mom and my sister. I think I have the Strawberry Coconut Cake one. From, ooh, this sounds good. Um, from Candles from the Keeping Room Tea and Cake. I may have to steal one of these. From Candles from the Keeping Room, Granny's Pie Crust. Another one I may have to steal one of. From the Kissing Booth Pineapple Princess. It's a bag of those like little lips. And sorry, I have a cold. My voice is not too bad today, but I am coughing a little bit. From Daphne's Iced Lemon Cookie. Scent shots. Candles from the Keeping Room. They have that. Candles from the Keeping Room Truth or Dare. Daphne's Blueberry Strawberry Cuppy Cake. Candles from the Keeping Room, I think that's Tropical Sugar, and it looks like maybe one of the grubbies has been used. Well, yeah, she used one, so it's only three in there. Tiffany Candles, it's a three-pack of her Teddy Tarts in Pecan Caramel Swirl. From the Bathing Garden Lemon Cheesecake, a full... From Better Homes and Gardens Wildberry Cheesecake. 
this one I think is an old label. So this one might be actually a little on the old side, but it smells really good. This is one of my favorite scents from them. Um, Tiffany Candles, a bag of her heart tarts in serendipity. So this whole bag does a lot. Mm, her serendipity is awesome. I love Tiffany Candles serendipity. Okay, just a few more. Um, candles from the Keeping Room, Grapefruit and Mango Steen. Candles from the Keeping Room, Mimosa Mandarin. Bora Bora. And I think, oh no, two more. Um, lemon ice box cookies. And then the last one from Candles from the Keeping Room, Raspberry Rainbow. And then, let's see. There's a few more from Tiffany Candles. This is zucchini bread. I love Tiffany's zucchini bread. She has an awesome zucchini bread. Um, love spell type. Um, from Candy Candles Coconut Cookies, and that's a vendor I have not tried, so I may hang on to this one to try it. Um, Lasting Scent Candles Lavender Lullaby. I'm gonna, I love lavender, but I'm going to give this one to my mom. Yeah, that's a nice, good lavender. It's nice and herbal. My mom loves lavender, and she's always complaining that I never give her any because I hoard my lavender. <laughs> so I think I'll share that one with her. Um, Virginia's Secret Recipe. From Lasting Scent candles. Hmm, smells pretty good. Very bakery and sweet. Another one of that same scent. Okay, two more from this box. Super Tarts White Walkers. I think I have this in a clamshell from her prime time opening. Is that the one it was from? No, that's her. That's the one she's doing now. What was the opening where she did like The Walking Dead and a lot of those other shows? I can't remember. 30 Street Rat, 30 Street Wax Hula Girl. Mm, nice tropical -y scent. So, um, all right, let me move this stuff out of the way. That was the first box, and I'll move this stuff so I can do the second one. So, now for the second box. Um, there is this massive thing from Lake Providence. Again, it looks like there was maybe a couple squares that were used, um, but fruit stand. I may have to smell this and um, keep maybe one of the squares, but because there's so much there. A bag from Glitterati and lemon biscotti, oops, sorry, lemon biscotti pineapple waffle cone. I think that's what the WC is. There we go. I'm gonna smell this really quickly because I love glitterati. That's pretty good. I may have to steal one of those as well. I don't know why I call it stealing. I paid for it, right? Um, Tiffany candles, uh, vanilla bean Noel with sugared cronut overpour. I'm gonna have to steal a couple of those. Tiffany Candles Strawberry Jam Chunks with Cake Batter Ice Cream Overpour. Probably have to steal a couple of those. I'm telling you, Kirby packs these things full. Um, a candles from the Keeping Room bag of four strawberry cookie, which I have a bag of this, so I don't need that. Here's one that I will probably keep for myself. This is 30 Street Wax, and this is from her pumpkin sampler. And it's Mile High Cream Pie, um, which is pie crust, pumpkin souffle, and pumpkin pie. That's the bottom. And then the whipped cream topping is whipped cream. That's really awesome looking. It's like a massive pie slice. And then this was exciting. This is a Rose Girl Pie in pomegranate watermelon slush, which I hear so many people talk about. Um, watermelon slush and I think this blend that I'm definitely gonna have to keep at least one of these slices for sure. Mm, I need to smell it. That smells good. I'm trying to see if there's any more large bags. Okay, from Sniff My Tarts Blackberry Jam Cookies. From candles from the keeping room, lemon summer cake. Bunch of grubby, not grubby, it's a little grubby squares. 
from Candles by Victoria Oatmeal Butterscotch Cookie. Candles by Victoria Strawberry Milk. Candles by Victoria Minty Twist, which this one smells really good. Oh, nice spearmint. I don't know if there's something else in it, but it mostly smells like spearmint. From Sugar and Spice Gourmet Soy Candles, this is Fruit Loop Vanilla Butter Fudge. This one, I don't know who it's from. There's actually a little hole in the bag. Um, is this from the bathing garden? The type of bag, I don't know if this is the right kind of bag. It feels very soft. Um, so, and there's not a lot of scent to it anymore. It's a very, 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 very light kind of tropical scent. So I think this might be bagged in the wrong thing. I don't know. From L3, this is pink sugar salted caramel popcorn. I'm going to have to try this one. Sounds very interesting. Mmm, that is interesting. You definitely like you pick up the pink sugar and the salted caramel popcorn. From Tiffany Candles, this is Barbie Girl. From L3, this is Acid Trip. I'm gonna have to smell that because I don't know what Acid Trip is. Mm, very, very like kind of citrusy, fruity kind of scent. From Rose Girls, Sicilian Lemon Cookies, Royal Sugar Cookies, Raspberry Coconut, and the little cupcake. From Rose Girls, Lemon Poppy Seed Cookies. From Beezies, that's a big one. Um, Love Spell, that's a really big scent shot. Is that how big all the scent shots are? I've never tried Beezies either. From 30 Street Crafts, Bahama Mama. From L3, Watermelon Strawberry Cream Peach Smoothie. The colors in this are gorgeous. I love the colors. From Candles from the Keeping Room, this is Blushing Peaches. Looks like it's a full bag. From Sniff My Tart Strawberry Kiwi Sorbet. I just smell this one. Oh, that's really good. I may have to keep one of those little kitty heads. From Candles from the Keeping Room, Island Oasis. From Lasting Scent Candles, Pink Sheets. I like how she bagged some of those scent shots in other bags so that they wouldn't leak. This one got a little smushy. Um, the Glitterati Candle Company, Blueberry Cotton Candy, Toasted Marshmallow sample. From Daphne's um, Caramelized Crimson Pear and Apples. Kind of loud. From 30 Street Crafts Vaudeville. And I think this has like a cantaloupe or something in it. it. Smells really good. Definitely like a melon, some kind of melon and like citrus. This is one I may have to keep as well because it smells really yum. Front Porch Strawberry Mint Ice Cream. It's a four pack. From Rose Girls Chocolate Dipped Waffle Cone. A nice big chunk. From Rose Girls Lemon Cotton Candy Cake Pops. From Candles by Victoria Tropical Cooler. I'm going to smell this one. Mm, it smells like pineapple coconut. From Sniff My Tarts, this is butterscotch bread pudding, and it's like in two little owls, although their eyeballs have fallen off. I don't know if you can tell that. They're little owl shapes. It's cute. Candles from the Keeping Room, vanilla, sorry, blueberry vanilla bomb. Rainbow Melts Wildberry Mousse Zucchini Noel. Candles from the Keeping Room Country 
Bear Strudel. The four pack. Oh, my pile is falling. From Haley's Heavenly Scents Toasted Bubblegum Cotton Candy. It's her, um, those four, the, what are those called? The words that she does. I don't know if you can see that where it says faith. It's not really focusing, but. Tiffany Candles Hocus Pocus, which this is some of her heart tarts that she does. The heart jar tarts, whatever they're called. From Super Tarts, this is Zerbert Kisses. Let me smell this one. Mm, that smells really good. What is that? I have a cold, so my nose is not working 100%. From Candles from the Keeping Room Cucumber Mint. This is one I may have to keep. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> From Vintage Chic Scents, this is Hot Dolce, which I have this in a three pack, so I will pass that on for sure. Um, Candles from the Keeping Room, Pink Sangria Bath and Body Works type. Orange Cranberry Relish. Another Miss Possum's Treats. bag in serendipity sugar cookie it's a four it's a four four piece bag whatever you call it mango and mandarins and i think that's it for candles from the keeping room from tiffany candles wintry candy apple hocus pocus Pink panties, which is, isn't that like pink sugar and love spell or something like that? From Super Tarts, The Force. It's a little bunt cake. Oh, here's another um, Candles from the Keeping Room Rock candy. This is a big pile of wax. From Better Homes and Gardens, Spiced Pumpkin Pie. Smells really good. From the bathing garden, Sea of Tears. She has some of the most beautiful clamshells. Shannon does. That's a very pretty scent. Beautiful scent. From the kissing booth, Going to the Sun. And Good Night. Glitterati Black Linen. Okay, just a few more. From Blasting Scent Candles Watermelon Wedding Cake. I have to smell this one. It smells pretty good. Very, very good. And Lasting Scent Candles Rock in the Tropics. fresh tropical scent. The lid is not wanting to stay on on this guy. I may have to put a bag, like put it in a bag so it's not staying on. From Sugar and Spice Gourmet Soy Candles, this is Peach Strawberry Cream Cake. That sounds really good. I think I'm going to have to sniff this. I don't know. Maybe it's not as good as I thought. I'm not sure if I like the peach and the strawberry together. And then three scent shots from Daphne's. So this is cake batter cookie flapjacks and tangerine colada cake. And the last one is blue Hawaiian. So that is everything. That is a ton of wax. So I'm super excited to be able to share this with my mom and my sister. So thank you for watching everyone. Bye.